And a group of people met in El Paso to show solidarity for trans migrants. KTSM 9 News reporter Susie Castillo live in the newsroom with this story. The rally brought people from across the country together to East El Paso to show support as well as bring awareness of violence against trans women. Some demonstrators say the death of a trans migrant woman in El Paso brought them here to protest at Edgemere Linear Park. It is our duty to fight. Earlier this month, 25 year old Joanna Medina, a trans migrant from El Salvador, died in El Paso after being released from the Otero County Processing Center. We're coming from all parts of the United States uh, to stand in solidarity with our migrant family, but to also uplift the lives lost um, as it pertains to black trans women. Organizers of the rally say violence against transgender women continues to happen. When we live in a society that doesn't value transgender women, it's um, the people in that society and in that culture are going to not act with love or treat trans women with dignity or respect, um, whether it's inside detention or outside detention. Organizers say while Pride Month is a cause for celebration, violence that targeted LGBTQ people in 1969 at Stonewall Freedom! is still killing LGBTQ people in prisons, detention centers, and inciting violence against them on the streets. When we are celebrating Pride, that we Remember that and honor the lives of the LGBTQ migrants who risk everything to come to this country um, to be able to live as who they truly are. The group is also remembering two black trans women who were killed in Dallas since last October. Reporting live in the newsroom, Susie Castillo, KTSM 9 News. All right, Susie, thank you very much.